Hi everybody, this is Gina from Designs for Screen and today I wanted to take a few minutes and show you how to easily customize a CorelDRAW template for a family reunion. Uh, you'll see on the shirt templates page of my website we have several different designs for family reunions. Anything from camping reunions to uh, you know, maybe you're going on a vacation, family vacation. <clears throat> and I'll, I'll be uploading a lot more family reunion designs as well. But um, let's just say you, you found the design you like, you've purchased it, downloaded it. Now it's time to customize it with your own family name, maybe the year, uh, and possibly the location where you're having the reunion. So if you have Corel Draw, um, you will receive a Corel Draw template. That's one of the templates you get, along with um, Adobe Illustrator and also PDFs that can be customized. But today I'm going to show you how to do it in Corel Draw. So you want to open up your Corel Draw template for your design. First thing it'll come up and ask if you want to create a new file from the template or just edit the template file itself. We want to create a new file, so click OK. That'll open it up for you. Now, whenever I save these templates, I always choose the option to embed the fonts that I used. So you'll see, like when you click on the name, the name of the font should come up. It should be in the file for you. Um, that way you're always using the same font so you get the same look as what was on the website. So the areas of this template that can be changed are of course the date and the family name. So all you want to do is just double click on Smith, double click again, it'll select the whole name and you can just simply type in your new name. Say you want to use O'Brien. You can just then click on the corner block to resize. Just shrink that down a little bit until it's the size you like. And I personally like to have it overlap just a little bit onto the word family, just like the way that looks. So that's about the size I like. Um, and then you want to make sure that it is centered on the page too. I like to keep my toolbox open here to the align and distribute because I use that all the time. Uh, if you click on this little icon here for the page, that will align any objects that you select to the page itself. So if I have that clicked and I click on O'Brien and I hit the center, align center horizontally, it will center it perfectly on the page for me. Then, of course, I want to change this to 2019, so I'll double click again there. Backspace 9, and I want to make sure that is centered too. And so you can see how quickly I was able to change that design for my family reunion this year. Now, this file is ready. Um, you could save it. Right now, it's not. It's untitled because I have not saved it yet, but um, you can save this to your computer and email it to any local screen printer to have shirts made for your family reunion. Um, that is definitely the cheapest way to go if you're going to have several shirts made um, is to have it screen printed. That'll give you your lowest cost per shirt. If you just need to get a couple shirts, you can always um, order those online somewhere. Um, just upload the design into any of the um, t-shirt creators or the, use the t-shirt creator on my site. You can do that too. Um, simply go to the designs page and create a t-shirt. That'll take you to my t-shirt designer where you can upload your design and order whatever shirts you want in whatever color, uh, have them shipped directly to you. So that's an option as well. If you ever have any questions or you need a custom family ring and t-shirt design, 
feel free to give me a call or email me and I'll be happy to help you with that. As always, enjoy. I'll talk to you soon.